Okay, so the first one we're going to do, <laughs> we just try and get him to stand as square as possible. Now, as I say, he's a young horse, so it's not that square, but it's not bad. Carrots, yes, carrots are better because they can nibble and you can hold the stretch, okay? So, keep the carrot quite close to his nose so he's not snatching, and then bring him round like that. So you can hopefully see the flexion through his neck. He's keeping his head pretty straight, so he's not twisting here, and all of his neck has stretched round. Hold it for about five, five to 15 seconds and repeat it three times on each side if you can. Good boy, stand, stand, good boy. And long and low, you can do it higher, but I prefer, I think this gives a bigger stretch. Good boy. Yes, I know there's a bit there on the floor as well, isn't there? Yes. Yeah. And if your horse, he's doing pretty well actually, he's standing st quite straight, but if your horse tends to follow you around rather than twisting, or stretching, you put them against the fence or do them in the stable where there's not much room for them to move around. Good boy, here we go, long, that's it, good boy. So what you never want to do with these is bounce the stretch. So you don't want to kind of stand here and then the with the carrot and then the horse kind of twists, gets it and goes back again. That's not gonna help anyone. And you will often find when you do these that they're slightly, find it slightly harder one way than the other he finds this way a little bit harder and you'll find that that might translate into the work you do under saddle so sometimes it might be better if you do maybe a little bit maybe one more on this side just to try and even him up a bit good boy and just take it down as far as you can do it this one this one good boy uh -uh. No. <laughs> good boy. <laughs> good boy. That's it. Good boy. There you go. Good boy. <laughs> so actually, you know, just take it as far as he's comfortable. And basically, if you can do those stretches when he's warm, as many times as you can really um, during the day, just three lots of 10, 15 seconds holding the stretches. Three times a day would be perfect. I know we, at the moment we haven't got that much time, so as many times as you can. As long as he's warm and he's safe and he's moving himself around, you're not going to do any harm.